Tito Orch and Eleven on Dawn, Joey Moses joining us as well. So it's time to get to know you guys a little bit here. Um, so, uh, I mean, so so first of all, like you guys are, of course, with uh, uh, Prospect Pro Wrestling, uh, IWC, you know, big in the area here over the last uh, few years. So, so those those who don't know, who, who, who is Tito and Eleven on Dawn uh, uh, in, in wrestling? So I perceive myself as the Pablo Escobar of professional wrestling. I am the Shaw of the squared circle. I am, you know, the reason those people are in their seats because I own the seats and I own the people in them. Um, I've grown up with a silver spoon and I met Tito Wardich probably the summer before COVID. Um, I was, I was in Europe uh, and Tito was, he was a bouncer at a nightclub and I went outside to take a phone call and I remember seeing Tito. He was, I, it, it was actually unbelievable. So he picked up this man. This man was being a very, you know, um, disobedient. This, and Tito picked him up off his feet. And this man may have been, you know, six foot tall. Tito lifted him up off his feet and proceeded to headbutt him so hard. This man looked like he had a, his face became a, a deflated basketball. Um, and I said to myself, you know, this man, as in Tito, can be something. So, um you know, once, you know, wrestling came back after COVID, um, you know, we, we've been, you know, I, I made him an offer to, to come in and be part of what we're doing. And, and we, we've been doing, we've been doing this ever since. Mm -hmm. So you guys have been, um, uh, you know, in, in, involved in some interesting feuds over, over the last few years, uh, especially with prospect pro wrestling. Mm -hmm. Um, I know, I know yourself, uh, uh Joey Moses, you had, um, some moments with a, a longtime friend of the show here in, um, uh, the Reveron hunt for a while mm -hmm. even i we do feature in the uh, intro to 2pw um your um matching styles i don't know if you were having a style <laughs> off at the time or something like that uh so uh, his shirt was fake mine was real so oh was, i see yeah, oh i very, see right. so. yeah so. Um, but you know, you know, things like that. Uh, so, and, and of course, Tito's been, um, you know, uh, several months over the summer here, uh, was involved with the country hammer, Jamie Jameson, the current, uh, top prospect champion, of course. Mm -hmm. Yeah, absolutely. And he, and, and uh, Tito beat him once. Um, he, they, they took each other to the brink. Uh, there was a, a board with barbed wire involved at some point. Um, so, you know, Tito doesn't back down from any, any fight. And I, I hope that, you know, Tito does get another another shot against Jamie Jameson. I think that, uh, you know, I, I, I honestly think, and, you know, this is my personal opinion, that I think the wrong person is the champion. I think Tito Ward should be walking around with the Prospect Pro Wrestling Championship and not uh, not Jamie Jameson, but that's just me. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, Tito, uh, you know, I, I, I know you don't speak, you know, much for English, but you have any words for Jamie Jameson? <laughs> <laughs> uh, that is a middle finger. That is definitely universal, uh, along with that. <laughs> so, um, uh, of course, you guys, you know, Two PW is known for a lot of um, tag team wrestling, and uh, and it feels like it's is is just uh, beginning to uh, maybe ramp up a little bit here as well. Uh, you know, uh, you know, you, you guys have been uh, involved in a few matches uh, uh, together, including the Rad Boys. Um, um, just uh, yeah, yeah, in December last time you were there, I know you guys didn't make the the show this month because um, I think you were. Uh, oh, what was? What, I remember we we put the promo out uh, right before uh, you were. Uh, you were you were occupied. Yeah, you were vacationing. Yeah. You're already scheduled. I understand it's the new year and you you got a. Uh, I don't know, frequent flyer points or something like that. Yeah, is that, is was, that the case? You know, I don't, I don't do the cold weather uh, very well. So okay. it was, uh, you know, I knew the snowstorm was coming, and I I said, you know, I I, I let Marshall know, you know. Well, I'll be back and uh, came back. Uh, we actually came back in yesterday um, after the snow hit. And uh, yeah, I just couldn't. I just don't, in time I don't for do the snow show. very well. Yep. Just in time for the show. I mm -hmm. appreciate that. Yep, I course. definitely appreciate that. So tell me a little bit about, um, you know, like I said, you got you got a little bit of a, you know, a, a tag team legacy here with the two of you guys. Um, you know, what does that division look like for you? What are you gunning for? The runway, uh, Calvin Couture mm -hmm. and uh, and uh, and uh, Tyler Klein, of course, are the champions right now. Yeah, I mean, to be honest, I think it's a very uh, well-rounded tag team division. I know that the ETF. Have, you know, the Rad Boys, you know, I, we would love to, you know, destroy them um, at some point uh, once again. But we've been, you know, working, feuding with now uh, the Sons of Liberty, um, I, which, you know, I own Super Hentai now. 
Um, Dennis yeah. Gregory is sitting there with a concussion probably after Tito threw him into a chair. Uh, well, we roll that back because mm-hmm. uh, Super Hentai is a long time friend of the show. I mean, mm-hmm. an over twenty year veteran in the game here in Pittsburgh, and and I under, I know I know in an our promotion over at RWA he had he had uh, mm-hmm. lost his name because of a match with Jason Gorey. Mm-hmm. Um, or Gory, who I don't know, maybe he lost his first name. I'm not sure where we're at with that either. Um, <laughs> but then, then the next two PW, um, explain you, you, you somehow you acquired that dropped name of Super Hentai and uh, AHL Supreme. I did, yes. Yeah. So you know, the trademark was never renewed, and I saw that afterward, um, and I decided to purchase it. It went to the highest bidder, and I don't think anybody's going to outbid me. Um, so I decided to, to purchase it and, you know, I will continue to do whatever I want with it. Like I said, I can make, you know, super hentai markets. I can do super hentai Mario and whatever it is, I, whatever I want to do with super hentai is, you know, you know, I can make it, you know, make socks with it if I want to. So, um, I'm going to make it a lot bigger than he ever has. So that's for sure. Interesting. Are, are we going to be, is there some integration with what's going on here at 2PW? Are we going to see a Tito super hentai orch? Maybe could be. you never know. You know, I, I that's the thing. You know, I, I you know we could buy we could get Dennis Gregory too if we want. We I don't know. We could. Uh, I I I I'm I'm very much looking forward to doing a lot of different things with with my new newly acquired Super Hentai trademark name. So um, I would just be on the lookout for this year because we will continue to to keep using it, keep flaunting it wherever we go. So so can you give me a hint? Can I get? Mm-hmm. Are we looking at apparel? Are we looking at? At, at 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 a style where are we looking at uh uh are, are you going to be like bitcoin mining with this like radio shack did yeah, it could be an, a, you know nfts it could be uh you know we you know the tito orch over here is wearing a a very lovely vest we can make super hentai you know kevlar vests you mm-hmm. know, there's a lot of things that we can do so um yeah, like I said, just be on the lookout for this year because it's uh, we're gonna we're gonna go global with it. Okay, okay, I'm looking forward to that. Super super hentai, hentai injuries in, industries, if you will, mm-hmm. not just a uh, fancy wrestler in a mask, <laughs> I suppose. Uh, so is that is that take does that imagery as well or just the name? Uh, just uh, as of right now, just the name. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. We're gonna have to rest. I'm, right. I'm sure yeah. the lawyers are involved. You can't can't say very much. Right. 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 So exactly. So so um, of course you got a lot going on here. Um, you know, tell tell me a little about Tito. You know, a little bit more about that origin. Uh, you know how mm-hmm. I, you know how long has uh, Tito been here in the states? You know, what was this the 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 upbringing in Bosnia that that that, that has uh, 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 enforced this guy to be you know such a such a force there in wrestling. Absolutely. So Tito grew up um, in a war-torn Bosnia in the early 90s, and um, I know he moved around a lot, um, lived in Germany, lived in different areas, and then he moved to the United States. Um, when well, he came here, you know, he came with me once I found him in Europe, but um, he, he does have some family here, um, but now at this point, um, he honestly is just an absolute wrecking ball when it comes to it. This, I, I, I think he was absolutely born to do this he's been absolutely born to you know be the bone breaker that he is and he's obviously done that before um you know like i said you know breaking the man's face he you know he did break core futuristics wrist at one point in a match so um he's lived up to his name the entire time and uh it, it, we're really just looking forward to to building you know seeing what we can do to to make him the the number one uh the number one star here um, in, in all of independent professional wrestling at this point. For sure. For mm-hmm. sure. Definitely imposing, uh, you know, I'm, I'm seeing him looking at me over here and, uh, and I'm wondering how much he's understanding what I'm <laughs> saying. Cause I don't know. I don't, I don't like the look he's been giving me lately. So uh, yeah. that's his, that's his happy face. Is, is that his, yeah, happy that's face? his happy face? That's his happy face. Okay. <laughs> uh, so I'm looking at a promo where he's saying he, he's telling somebody that they are broken. Uh, so, <laughs> So that was actually for Jamie, Jamie Jameson. Yeah, that was actually. Oh, for absolutely. Yeah. yeah, I think that was leaning into uh, yeah, one of those big ones. Um, was that so. the strap match? I can't remember. That. I think that was the strap. Oh uh, yeah, the... it was the dime time one for the looks of it. Uh, so um, so uh, so so you know, obviously, big things with Super Hentai, hentai Industry Industries mm-hmm. tag tag titles over or or. or or even top prospect title over it. You're just getting all of them. What do you think about the new? I don't know if you've seen the footage for it yet, um, but there's the new Anarchy Championship with 2PW. Of course, you know mm-hmm. part of the you know the the WWE three Memorial Show, a big thing that uh, Walter was a part of bringing in. And a fantastic big belt. I obviously seen it. I haven't seen it in sure. person yet, but it's a. 
it's the heaviest belt I think I've ever uh, held in is a it? long okay. time, too. So, uh, you know, uh, uh, is that something, uh, I figure that's something Tito may be a good fit for, uh, uh, d- you know, uh, um, match-wise, because mm-hmm. I mean, we've definitely seen him with the violence here in 2020. Yeah, I was going to say, I think the the biggest mistake was introducing that belt and interest- introducing that division, because that entire division, that entire belt was made for Tito Wardage. Uh, I did watch the footage back of the match, and, uh, you know, there's thumbtacks, there's trash cans, there's, you know, kendo sticks. Uh, you're asking for a lot if you're going to step into the ring in an anarchy-type style match with Tito Ordich. So, um, like I said, I think that was a big mistake on on, on on Prospect for Wrestling's part, but, you know, that belt's going to look right, really good around Tito Ordich's waist at some point. Absolutely. Uh, current cha- uh, champion Stevie LaBelle, friend of the show, he'll be uh, joining us here in a few weeks as well. Uh, any messages for him? I don't know. Uh, does Tito think? have yeah. any messages for Stevie there? <laughs> yeah, he's he's, he's doing, doing the, the belt. The discount double check, right? The Is discount the double check, <laughs> yes. <laughs> As well, but uh, again, I'd say that was a pretty vicious match. Uh, a little bit of footage coming up now. Him and uh, uh, Philip Archer um, there. I think he just took a trash can, and uh, of course, a lot of blood involved. Like I say it, it was it was it was pretty nice. Some of the sickest sickest kendo shots I think I've ever seen in person. Um, That's so. until you put a kendo stick in Tito Ordich's hand. Oh jeez. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> the worst thing was they had tiny, like short kendo, like baby kendo sticks. Mm which probably hurt much worse. And right, right. yeah, so, uh, so anyways, um, you know, uh, uh, you're always coming from, you know, I, I, you know, I get the promos, we put them on mm-hmm. the social media and you're always coming from the most interesting of places. So, uh, that's been interesting, uh, to watch as well. Um, so, uh, uh anything else, anything you're looking out, uh, outside of a uh, prospect pro wrestling, uh, uh, the wrestling world at large for the two of you? You know, th- this year, we, I th- we this is the year of of Don and Tito. We we really want to make an impact wherever we go, um, and it's going to start at two PW. You know, our we do have our eyes on, you know, the two PW Tag Team Championships. So, like I said, I feel bad for everybody that's going to be in that division moving forward. Um, but honestly, wherever you know, our 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 goal is to make twenty twenty two the year of Don and Tito. So, um, we want to make an impact wherever we go. We want to go you know as many places we possibly can to you know impose our will and and really just make a statement so um that's that's what we're that's what we want to do this year excellent excellent tito you got any final words here before we go to break mislim dobro mi pasalo kad bimo tri championa jedan dva tri sve tri uh, you got a little bit of translation for us there, or, or, or can we just inf- uh, read between the lines? With all the belts. All the belts. Jedan, dva, tri. At least you know sign language. Um, thank you so much. 